Hello everyone, this is Chubai Mahmood, a data driven digital marketing expert and a web analytics expert. In this video, I will tell you about how to set up for JAR a heat map tracking with Google Tag Manager and what is the benefit of for JAR. So, without any further delay, let's get started. So, as you see, the, this is the Horcher. I am in the Horcher website. Uh, my display is showing the Horcher website. It is basically a heat map tracking tool. Uh, like Google Analytics 4 will tell you this page has the highly bounced rate, but, but it doesn't tell you what happening in your website, how many people are clicking in your website, in which element. So, that's why the Horcher came into the picture and they will track the every link in your in your website you can see the you can see the uh, how people are uh, user are clicking on your website so it is basically a beach kind of thing and you can see this is the this is how you can uh, this is how it will be tracked some green areas there are uh, lots of click and it will tell you about the uh, uh, it will tell you about the which uh, are the main problem if if your website has UI UX problem it will tell you about which you need to improve which thing you need to improve so it uh, it it is very important tool for a website every business owner should add it in. so let me tell you about how to set up it with Google Tag Manager like your website has google tag manager right now i this is my test website and this website doesn't have the hot jar or the or this this website this website is connected to this tag manager it is i have made for this purpose and right now i have created uh, at first you have to came to hot jar website and go start with start with simple uh, task to set up the website when you came into your Google uh, account, sign up, and then you hear some few steps like, uh, like uh, your business name, I paste a test name, how many, how many employee. Okay, um, this is what do you like to first, what would you like to do first in Hotjar? Heat map, this one, this one, this one, I skip this, this one, no, never. Then I done this and it will uh, show interface like this, where do you install your uh, Hotjar, you, you have to paste your website URL in here. And then Hotjar give you a install Hotjar. It is manually uh, manual code. If you want, if you don't have Google Tag Manager, you can add it go in your backend, website backend, and paste it uh, with your plugin called header and footer. And uh, you can you can paste this. You can copy this copy this one and go into your website uh, appearance then theme theme file editor then header.php then below your head tag below your head tag you can paste this code you can paste this code and update this file right now we are not uh, doing this way we will, we will be added added this this one with a Google Tag Manager that's why this Tag Manager is connected in this website so how can we connect it we will first uh, create a new tag and here you see uh, tag configuration and here we search the Horger search Horger tracking code here you see the Horger uh, site ID here you see the site ID code this is the site ID code copy it from here and paste it here and trigger it all the page then save it 
I'll save this this tag. You can just save this tag and submit it. Submit it up. And uh, after after the installation, after the uh, the other way installation is Google Tag Manager. Here is the Google Tag Manager. Right now we will verify our our hotjar tracking is well clearly track or not. Then we will go here and verify our verify our uh, hotjar. And here you see the here is a success message. It shows that our verification has completed and here you see this is the this is the dashboard after a few hours uh, or few days the data will be come up here here will be the right now it is a newly newly installed that's why the data is not showing and uh, there is a highlight there is the trend uh, funnel like uh, you can see the user journey this if you view the if you view the website we will see the right now we are viewing the website and we can see the uh, horger will be connected the horger tracking code is fired right now the horger is fired uh, and after the after the time we will see the horger tracking and reporting heat map data will be coming so this that's all for today's video if you if you get anything informative from this video uh, make sure you have subscribed the channel and i will be coming up with another brand new video so till then take care goodbye and tata thank you